Hey everyone, it is Fitz with The Daily Delivery. Hope you're doing well. K-State goes to 3-0 on the young season, sweeping that non-conference schedule, heading into Big 12 play Saturday night at Oklahoma State. The Cowboys are also 3-0. That really important matchup in the Big 12 will be shown on ESPN+. Plus. It's only available for streaming. That's life with ESPN. Hey, today's Daily Delivery is about something I ask on Twitter over the weekend, do you find yourself watching BYU, Cincinnati, Houston to a lesser extent maybe, and Central Florida as if they're already in the Big 12? I thought it was pretty funny that at the stadium on Saturday during the K-State Nevada game, they listed the games from those teams with the Big 12 games. That was a good touch. I do. I find myself really intrigued by these teams. I almost feel like I'm pre-scouting. I'm preparing for them to come into the conference, whether it's in 23 or 24, whenever that'll be. I want to have a good feel for them. Cincinnati's really good. The Bearcats are in the top 10. They, they might be the best team in the Big 12 if they were in the league this season. I'm not sure, but I would love to watch them play Oklahoma and see what happens. I don't know. They're really, they're really fun to watch. And BYU, how about the Cougars? First of all, let me say this. I've watched a couple of BYU games now from out in Provo. I can't wait to go. That environment looks fantastic. It uh, is rowdy. It's fun. It's loud. It's college football at its finest. And the crowd really impacted how Arizona State was operating in the game. They couldn't get the snap off half the time. That's right. BYU is now 3-0 and against the Pac-12 South. The Pac-12 didn't think any of the leftover Big 12 teams are good enough to help the league out, but a team the Big 12 picked up would be winning the Pac-12 South and going away right now because the Pac-12 as a whole is hot trash. You mix in Oregon, uh, the one decent team right now up north. <clears throat> the South is just awful. It's just pathetic. Someone's going to win it, and that's another reason why you don't have divisions. Schedule with pods. I love these additions to the conference. Uh, Houston, I'm, I'm a little bit cooler on. I'm going to say it. I mean, I don't, that was the one I didn't really have a feel for, but I didn't have anyone that I really thought was better. I wanted South Florida, but were they better as a football team? No. Houston's 2-1. and one. Central Florida's 2-1. and one. Unfortunately, the Knights lost their quarterback for the season. BYU and Cincinnati are unbeaten. These are great additions to the conference, and I'm really fired up for what the Big 12 has in store for the future. And honestly, I'm really changing on this. I wish it started next year. I wish we were gone and done with OU in Texas as soon as possible. We'll see how it plays out, but it's going to be fun.